the Puddleball Caddis variant is a minor adaptation of the Puddleball Caddis. Where the original has a hackle collar, I prefer to use Snowshoe Rabbit to make for a lower riding pattern that sits flush in the film. The hooking device is a Chemco 102Y size 15. In most other brands and models this would be a size 14. And the thread is Benecci 12 volt in tan. Attached just back of the eye. About a third and then the waist is trimmed. A slender body is formed with touching turns of thread running the full length of the shank. Then returning to one third from the eye. Like this. The extended body is some close cell one and a half mil foam. In this case I'm using gray. Use any color to match your local insect. I've cut it to about three to four mil wide and again it's the one and a half mil thick. This will form the extended body. The full length of the piece of foam is from the front of the eye to the back of the hook. But when it's tied in, it obviously will extend slightly past the bend. In order for the extended body to lie flush, a small amount of super glue is used. on top of the hook. Then simply press down and hold for a few seconds. Needs a little longer. For the wing a small amount of deer hair is placed in a hair stacker and the tips are evened. Remove any broken tips, in this case there aren't any. The length of the wing is slightly longer than the body. Tied in on top, lift up some of the butts. Bring forward. Butts and trim them. Trim them short. And tidy up slightly. For the head or the thorax of this fly, I use some uh, snowshoe hair or snowshoe rabbit. I've cut away a small clump which will be inserted into split thread. So the thread is flattened.
not split. The snowshoe. Stand inserted. And the thread is allowed to close. Now, just tease it down. Next, spin the bobbin holder. And allow the, the twist to run up the thread. Fold back to wing, start to wrap, brushing back. the snowshoe hair or rabbit with each turn till you've run out of uh, snowshoe rabbit have the empty thread then finish off with a three turn whip finish next it's trimmed flush underneath. That completes the Puddaba Caddis variant. A low riding caddis or stonefly imitation tied in a range of sizes and colors to match the insects in your local waters.